Hi guys and welcome back to another episode brought to you by Danny Lad UK and in this episode we're going to talk about installing Terrarium TV back on your fire stick. Terrarium TV is back and it's back with a bang. It's working bang on. So let's waste no more time. Let's get straight in straight after this. Hi guys and welcome back. In this episode we will not need a computer for this so all you will need to do is go on your fire stick and use your remote. I have pre-recorded this so what I'm going to do I'm going to talk you all the way through it and if anyone gets any problems don't hesitate not to message me just drop a comment down below and I'll get back to you. So let's not waste no more time and let's get straight in. Alright guys as you can tell we're at the menu now so what we're going to do we're going to go across to my fire tv First of all, we need to go down to the developers options. The developers options are key to for this whole thing to work. So we need to make sure ADB debugging is on, USB and install from unknown sources. And then we need to go back into the settings and make our way to the home. So what we're going to do, we're going to go all the way to the left. We're going to scroll up and we're going to hit the search button and we're going to search for downloader. And once we've hit that, it should bring up the app. And we're just going to install it from the home screen. So install it from there. It doesn't take long. It's not a very big file at all. So once you've installed it, we need to open it up. Click OK. Right. So this is the address that you're going to need to input, guys. I will put the link for this in the description. So it's www but make sure you do have your HTTPS in, guys. Uh, that is vital for this to work. So, HTTPS, double colon, forward slash, forward slash, www.firestickstricks.com, forward slash, TTV. And once you've done that, guys, just click your go button. And that's it. What it's doing now is actually downloading you Terrarium TV from its source. So once this is now installed, we are going to install it from the APK itself. So if you click next, install. And it's installed. Right, so what I'm gonna show you now is at Toy TV. For, I'll pause that again, just wait, for, just bear with me. For Terrarium TV to work its best, we really need to install MX Player. If you don't know how to install MX Player, if you look in my previous videos, I will show you how to install Aptoid TV, and Aptoid TV has both applications that you need to install MX Player. Terrarium TV will run without MX Player, but it will run within its own player and it will bring up loads of ads and they're just trying to promote their own player basically but it runs a lot better in mx player so if we just carry on so there's mx player all you'd have to do is click install obviously i've got it installed so i don't want to install that and then you go across to the codec which is arm7 neon so that's the codec for mx player to run and now we've opened up Terrarium TV and just to show you guys that this is running absolutely flawlessly as you see I select MX player as I have it installed you can use the Terrarium Zone um, we go over now to movies uh, we select a new recent movie on Netflix Bird Box so you click the OK button press your play button and just wait for your links so once your links have loaded shouldn't take too long find your best link I'm sure a lot of you are aware on how to use Terrarium TV but if you're not even you're new to this Terrarium TV was the best app for movies and TV shows so click it there we go it's really quick it's back to how it was in the original stages I do skip it a couple of times just to show you that it doesn't buffer on the skip either 
This is running on an old Fire Stick, by the way. This isn't on the 4K one. This is actually in, on the other Fire Stick I've installed. Uh, I'll go back now to show you a TV series. So you go to your top left, TV series, movies. So the TV series, I think I click on Vikings. Yep, choose your season. Yeah, we go across to season eight, and it's exactly the same, guys. Just click the play button on the remote or the play button in the top right hand corner. And this will show you that it's all working. And there we go. That's it, Terrarium TV. That's Terrarium TV working back to how it was. So I hope you've enjoyed the video, guys. So there you have it. We have Terrarium back for 2019. So if you guys enjoyed this video, make sure you hit the thumbs up, drop a comment down below, please subscribe, and I will catch you in the next one.